known as Diddy, facing a fourth accusation of sexual assault. In a federal lawsuit filed Wednesday against the three-time Grammy winner, an unnamed woman alleges Combs and two other men, including a former longtime president of Combs' record label, gang-raped her in a New York recording studio 20 years ago when she was just 17 and a junior in high school. The woman says it all began when she met two associates of Combs at a Detroit lounge. According to the lawsuit, which includes these photos allegedly taken that night, they convinced her to get on a private plane with them to New York, where they then plied her with drugs and alcohol. It's there, she says, the three men took turns raping her in the studio's bathroom. When they were done, the lawsuit says they drove her to the airport and put her back on a plane to Michigan. Combs denies the allegations, posting on Instagram Wednesday, enough is enough. For the last couple of weeks, I have sat silently and watched people try to assassinate my character, destroy my reputation and my legacy. Sickening allegations have been made against me by individuals looking for a quick payday. Let me be absolutely clear, he continued, I did not do any of the awful things being alleged. I will fight for my name, my family, and for the truth. This woman, now the fourth person in recent weeks to raise accusations against Combs, some including rape and trafficking. Last month, his former longtime partner, singer Cassie, whose real name is Cassandra Ventura, filed a graphic lawsuit claiming Combs raped and physically abused her over the course of a decade. That complaint accuses Combs of uncontrollable rage and alleges that he often punched, beat, kicked and stomped on her. Cassie and Combs reached a settlement in that lawsuit without disclosing terms of the agreement. Two other women have also alleged in recent lawsuits that Combs sexually assaulted them. Allegations Combs also denies. And the lawsuit says the first three women to come forward with allegations against Combs gave this fourth woman the confidence to share her story. She says as a result of the alleged incident, she has suffered significant emotional distress that guys has plagued her life for 20 years. Right. Well, of course, thank you. Thank you.